recently discovered species of seaweed is killing large patches of coral and it's rapidly spreading across one of the most remote ocean environments on Earth. News 8's Alicia Summers spoke with a local researcher to find out just how destructive the seaweed can be. The new species of seaweed is spreading faster than anything ever seen before in the northwestern Hawaiian Islands. There's a threat lurking in the ocean, but it's not a shark. It's a type of seaweed. So it's a red seaweed, and according to the study, it's a seaweed that has never been found before. Its name is Chondria tumulosa. Here's one of Scripps Institution of Oceanography's coral reef experts, Jennifer Smith. And the Hawaiian Islands in general have been plagued by a lot of invasive species over their history of colonization, and so another one even introduced to the main Hawaiian Islands could be pretty devastating, especially given how aggressive this thing seems to be. The seaweed is killing large patches of coral in a remote and protected marine environment in Hawaii, and it's rapidly spreading. It's really concerning is that it's very rare. It's, it's very alarming to find that there's something that is behaving like an invasive species. This is a nuisance seaweed. You don't typically find something coming into an environment and causing this level of alarm and simply not knowing what it is or where it might have come from. A study from the University of Hawaii says the seaweed is destroying a nature reserve that stretches more than 1,300 miles north of the main Hawaiian islands. Researchers spotted the algae during a routine survey back in 2016. Last summer, they returned to find the algae had taken over huge areas of the reef. And so all of a sudden, it was at this abundance that was very alarming, overtaking large parts of the reef at Pearl and Hermes Atoll. Scientists say individual mats of the seaweed were as big as several soccer fields and could threaten the entire Hawaiian archipelago if it spreads. At this point in time, it's not concerning to me for like from San Diego's point of view. This is a tropical species, so it's likely not to be successful in California. Researchers simply don't know much about it yet, where it came from or how to manage it. But if it did get to the main Hawaiian islands, it could be an ecological and economical disaster. Back to you. It's alarming, and what really struck me about that report is that the experts here in San Diego at the Scripps Institution of Oceanography aren't really overly familiar with this either and are very concerned about it. I guess the best news right now is that they've got an eye on it while it's still off in the distant portion of the Hawaiian Islands. Hopefully it's, it's an isolated area and it doesn't rage through coral reefs because that would be a disaster. Oh, just awful. Terrible.